Wait, Sonic Clients is out? Let me copy and paste this. Yo, no way! Oh my god! <laughs>Hey guys, what's going on? It's Axel here, back with another video. And you guys might be wondering about the title. What do you mean, Zong's Client? It is now downloadable. It is now out, and at the end of the video, I will show you guys how to download it. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys the best settings for it, to show you guys, like, for best FPS boost. And it does boost your FPS. I get, usually right now, probably getting 1 to, like, 200 FPS. So it does boost a little, depending on how good your actual PC is. So here's the settings that I use. I have armor status on, and I have that up here. I have combo on. It just shows how much like hits in a row you get on someone. And then you just like click on it. You can drag it to wherever you want, but I like having mine like neat. I got coordinates on. Settings like you can just say um compact. Like I like the compact coordinates, so more than likely I'm just gonna end up using this. And then show direction, you can have the color of it, so now it's chroma. And then CPS, right there, which is chroma, C and CPS. Direction hub, which is the, like, the, which way you're going. I have that off, I'm not really a huge fan of that, but if you, if some people do like it, so. What is classic? Um, it was pretty cool, but I don't really, I'm not a huge fan of that. Then the FPS right here which you can also do whatever like color you want fps boost which this is my opinion you want to have everything on if you don't like clear glass you can like turn that off and then i would recommend depending on how bad your pc is like i i have mine around like seven chunks which keep it on that make sure everything else is turned on it makes it like pretty really good on fps um keystrokes like the keystrokes here, which I, I like it, like the chroma, and I like it showing like the mouse button and all that. Um, minimap, which let me go out of this, which is right there on the top right, as you guys can see. Which I don't, I'm not, minimap is bannable on some servers, so I wouldn't recommend having that on unless you know it's not bannable. Pot counter, which shows how much pots you have. Uh, potion status, which shows, like, the potion effects you guys have. You guys probably already know this. Reach display, um, scoreboard, which shows the, like, the, what server you're on, all the stats. Time changer, just, like, you can change it to whatever you want, so, night only, or, you can change it to natural, which is the actual time, which I don't really, I mean, I don't know why I had that on, I guess, just toggle sneak, which is your... Like your toggle sprint, sneak, fly boost, double tap, W, like your fly boost amount, color. What you, you can see what the text you want it to look like is. Um, and that's pretty much the settings now for that. And then like there's, it still has Optifine, all that. And so I'll show you guys and what it's like without this, without um, Zonix Client my FPS, and I'll show you guys with Zonix Client, so I'll be back with you guys in a couple of seconds. Alright guys, we are back, and as you guys can see, I'm just on my, like, regular forge, uh, left shift, nothing comes up, right shift, and I'm just, like, regular options, and you guys can see I'm getting around 120, 130 FPS, because I'm right at the spawn, but if I run over here on these PvP things, it should go up in the two, three hundreds, should at least, and then, yeah. And then that's what I get a regular, and just to show you guys, like, I am just on the forge, I'll disconnect, and it's just Minecraft, and it's Minecraft 1.7 forge, and, like, all forge servers, like, just regular servers. So I'll see you guys in a couple seconds when I'm back on Zonix to show there is a difference in the FPS boost. Alright guys, what's going on? So we are back, and you guys can now see I'm on Zonix client. I click on the multiplayer, it shows all their servers, but I'm going to join Vel PvP gun just to show. And... So, right off the bat, I spawned in with 100 and something, but let me go to practice like I was before. Wait for a minute to load. And you guys can see I'm already getting a lot more than what I was. It's not a huge FPS boost, but it still does help when it comes, like, I'm not lagging half as much. And then if I come over here, like, it's already a lot higher. It's, like, already almost in the 300s. Down here. Yeah. It is a pretty, it is a FPS boost. It does help a lot. So I'll pause this just so you guys can see the settings really quick. You guys want to pause it here. And 
Uh, I'll show you guys how to download here, download it here again in a couple of minutes. So I'll see you guys in a couple of seconds. All right, guys, so we are back. So what you want to do is you want to search in Zonix, and it comes zonix.us slash. It brings you this website here, or just search in like uh, Zonix client or whatever, and it comes up their server, their website here, and then there should be this here. Zona Client V1.1 Hotfix has these. This link right here, you want to copy this link. Come up here, you want to paste it in. And then it says Google Drive can't scan because it's like such a big file. Download anyway. And then when it's downloaded, you just launch it. It takes a couple of minutes to launch, but it is really good. Like it does make your FPS better and stuff. So I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. And if don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Peace out, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Tell me pretty lies. Look me in the face. Tell me that you love me, even if it's fake.